Hey everyone, so today I am going to talk about Paula's Choice BHA9 and my experience with it. So uh, let me go ahead and get started and I'm going to start by not taking any credit for discovering this product. I just always like to give credit where credit is due and I don't want to pretend like, oh my gosh, I just like totally fell upon this product. No, I didn't. Um, I heard about this through Lauren from Redhead PhD. I talked about this in my favorites video. She talked about it in a favorites video, raved about it. I have some skin issues, some stubborn skin issues that I have been wanting to take care of and that have just been really persistent and really bothered me. So she raved about this product. I knew that I had to order a sample size and so that's what I did. So this is the product that I received. It's again, the Paula's Choice Resist BHA9. If you're not familiar with me and my videos, I'm not sponsored by Paula's Choice or anybody. I'm just talking about my experience with this product. And I am more on the sensitive skin side. And I say that because if I use a foundation or a powder or any skincare item that just does not agree with my skin, my skin will immediately react and I'll start breaking out. So I would consider myself more on the sensitive skin side. BHA9, it does like nine things. Uh, BHA stands for beta hydroxy acid and it's for those really stubborn imperfections where you're to the point where you've tried so many products and nothing else has worked. This is where this product comes in. Okay, so really quick, it says that it diminishes bumps, spots, redness, and wrinkles. I'm gonna talk more about that. But uh, this is what the inside looks like. That's what the packaging looks like. Not that it even really matters because this is nowhere near the actual packaging of the product, but I'm just gonna show you what you can expect to get. It talks about the nine things that you can get there, how to use it on the back. It'll tell you the ingredients and a precautionary disclaimer. So I will let you know if you are allergic to aspirin, this product is not for you. It is not recommended for people allergic to aspirin. So I just wanna put it out there because if you try it and you're allergic to aspirin, I am not responsible whatsoever for any of your medical bills, any uh, negative effects that you get. So make sure that you do the research yourself before you try this product, okay? So this is the actual size of the product that you're getting. It's a small vial like this. So when they said it was a deluxe sample and I opened it, I thought this is not a deluxe size sample. I'm sorry, but that's not what I consider a deluxe size sample. I don't have anything to go off of, but I would consider a deluxe size sample like something more in like a tube, maybe this big. But this is what I received. And I do have to say, I think I get what they're go where they're going with this. This is not a deluxe sample size, but the amount that you get is sufficient and it's enough for gosh, like a month's worth at least. I mean, I've been using this product for two weeks. I've seen amazing results and I still have about another, probably about another week and a half left. So that's what it looks like. You should also know that with Paula's Choice, they do not test on animals. They are color and fragrance free. So really, really good product. Okay, so let me go ahead and get my notes out and start sharing some facts with you. This deluxe size sample was $3.50. Now I only ordered one because when somebody raves about something, I'm just always a little skeptical because I know that products work differently for everybody. I've said that in so many, if not every one of my reviews. So I only ordered one. I found a free shipping code on retailmenot.com. So make sure you check there if you want free shipping. I have a free shipping code for you that I found on there. I will link it down below so you don't have to go look for it. Now, if you watch this video weeks from now, months from now, years from now, then obviously it's probably not going to work. But if you, it is something that you're interested in, I do have that code for you down below so you don't have to look for it. So $3.50 for the deluxe I sample, free shipping. I also received three samples that I got to choose from. Shipping was extremely fast. I think they shipped out like the next business day. I received everything within a matter of days. So really, really super fast shipping. Very, very happy with that. Um, now the full size bottle that you get is 0.3 ounces. It was on sale recently. It's now back to its regular price. But if you go to Paula's Choice and you sign up for her newsletter, she will email you or somebody obviously from her team will email you and let you know what sales and promos they have going on. You can also check her website because it always has like a today special or daily special, something like that. So um, yeah, but if $36.95 is a little bit too much, for you, I would say get the deluxe size sample or check back to see when it's on sale. But I mean, if you have really stubborn issues, I would highly re recommend that you either just invest in the full size bottle or invest in a sample. $3.50 is nothing. As far as the ratings go, it did receive four stars out of five. That's based off of 423 reviews 
which is amazing. Okay, so what makes this product unique? Resist BHA9 is a first of its kind spot treatment specifically formulated to address your most stubborn skin imperfections. Uh, technology behind BHA9 is unique, allowing for a controlled, sustained release of salicylic acid without diminishing any of its, any of its effectiveness. I'm gonna, it says it, you're not gonna have any dryness or irritation. It's for stubborn imperfections. How many times are we gonna say that? And it has a pH range of 3.2 to 3.5. The amount of salicylic acid that you're getting in this product is 9%, which is absolutely amazing. I feel like that's almost prescription strength because the general amount that you get of salicylic acid in like any over-the-counter cleansers, if you look at over-the-counter cleansers and spot treatments, I think the, the standard is 2% because sometimes you'll see like 0.5%, but standard is 2%. So the fact that you're getting 9% in this vial is absolutely amazing. And the fact that you can like skip seeing a dermatologist and paying for your, you know, office, ex your visit, your office visit prescription, you can skip all of that and just get like everything with one product. So basically here's what it can do. It can, here's nine things that it can do. And then I'll talk a little bit more about them. Unclog pores with the first use diminish white bumps, minimize enlarged pores, refine and smooth skin's texture, minimize sebaceous hyperplasia, I don't know, smooth and soft and dry rough patches, help balance oily skin, fade red marks from breakouts, and reduce breakouts. So it's effective for acne breakouts, anti-aging, blackheads, brown spots, enlarged pores, keratosis pilaris, redness, rosacea, and wrinkles. That's a lot of stuff. Okay, so let's talk a little bit more about um, what it can do in more detail, I guess. It's going to reduce your clogged pores, diminish your enlarged pores, reduce white bumps or milia. With that said, it does say to keep out of the eye area. You're not supposed to use it like on your lid or underneath your lashes. You can use it up to your orbital bone. So that's pretty much it. Minimizes flesh colored bumps, which is sebaceous hyperplasia, plasia, why, seriously, why are scientific terms so hard to pronounce? Why did they have to make, why can't they just call it sebaceous hyper? I don't know. Okay, softens rough, dry, and flaky skin, calms redness and irritation, fades marks from past breakouts, reduces wrinkles and fine lines, helps clear stubborn blackheads, clinically proven to be non-irritating, and 100% fragrance-free, no added dyes. Okay, so let me tell you my experience with this product and why I wanted to try this and what it's done for me, how I use it, that kind of thing. So basically, I have some acne scars that have left, you know, discoloration on my face. Um, I have one right here. I have it right here in this area. I also have one, where is it? Right here. So those technically, they can, you know, be covered up by using concealer. Not really a big deal. Do I want to diminish them? Absolutely. But... I don't know that I would have ordered this product for that. I just, you know, it's just no, not a big deal for me. However, I do have one issue that just really bugs me. I don't know if, if it's what, I don't know if it's this flesh colored bump, that sebaceous hyperplasia, plasia, whatever. I don't know what it is. I don't know what caused it, but it really, really bothered me. So it's this bump right there. I don't know if you can see that. Right here. Okay, it was raised, it was kind of like a pimple, but there was nothing in there. It was very pink in color and just raised and just really bothered me. That was the one thing that I really wanted to see if this product could take care of. This is supposed to be used as a spot treatment, so I have applied it. I have been using this product for two weeks. I applied it on the acne scars and this baby right here. Within 24 to 48 hours, I could visibly notice a difference in color, in size. It is truly, this has truly been like a miracle product for me. I don't feel like I ever wanna go the rest of my life without using this product. Dramatically reduced it. So I've been using this again for two weeks. In the two weeks that I've been using it, this bump right here has gone down significantly. I mean, huge, huge difference in the size that it was before and the size that it is now. I'm going to be honest with you. I thought about taking a before and after picture, but I just didn't even know if this was going to work. And I'm sorry for that. 
that's my own fault because that would this would be like a huge testimony to how far I've come with this product. Like every single day that I use this, it just keeps getting better and better and better. So I use this treatment every single night without fail. There's not one night in the last two weeks that I have gone without using this. I put all my other skincare items first, anything else that I'm using, and then this is the very last step that you're supposed to um, you're supposed to apply it as your very last step, I guess is what I'm trying to say. So what you do is you're supposed to take a pea size amount onto a clean fingertip and just massage it over that area and just leave it on overnight. I also want to let you know that this will help fade acne scars if you have like any, what does it say, pink, red, or brown marks known as post-inflammatory hyperpigmentation, which I guess is basically what I have right here. These, these two areas right here is where I have post-inflammatory hyperpigmentation. Golly, that's long. So it will help with that, but it's not going to affect those deep or pitted scars that come with cystic acne. So I just wanted to point that out there because if you have had cystic acne and you have those deep scars, it's not going to help with that. And I just want to be fair and let you know that. But this has absolutely been amazing, amazing, amazing for me. And again, as I said in my favorites video, I just feel like by the time I'm done with this, they're going to be like almost nothing or gone. So I'm definitely ordering a full size bottle of this. I would highly, highly recommend it if you've had any stubborn imperfections, any hyperpigmentation, anything like that, that you've been trying to get rid of and you've been spending so much money just trying different over the counter pro products and um, just higher end products, I would just say skip all of that, try this. If you're skeptical like I was, get a sample of it you're going to absolutely love it. And I, I hear so many good things about Paula's Choice now. It's so funny because when you're not in the market for skincare, you kind of don't hear it. And now that I've been wanting to just really kind of revamp my skincare, I've heard so many good things about Paula's Choice. I know Georgette from NYC Georgette, she was talking about this line in her underrated products video, something like that. I will link that down below. But and now I'm hearing, and so many of my subscribers commented on that monthly favorites video and just said Paula's Choice is a must have for them. So I'm definitely, definitely switching over to Paula's Choice skincare. And um, I'll do a video on that once I like haul it in and that'll be later, but definitely switching over to Paula's Choice. I am sold on this brand, this line, this resist line. I'm absolutely sold on it. There is different lines of skincare that she has for different needs. So if you're not interested in this, but you want to look at her skincare, definitely go on her website. She has a little drop down menu that will help you find what products are best for your skin. But the resist line is definitely for me. I am sold on this brand. I love it. If you have any questions or comments, please leave them down below. If I'm not able to answer them, please refer to Paula's Choice website for more answers. There is a lot of information on there as far as ingredients. You can actually click on the key ingredient and it'll take you to a page on her website where it gives you information like on what that ingredient's good for. It has great FAQs on there. There is, you can contact customer service. So please, if you have any concerns, please make sure to check her website or call customer service. I am obviously not a doctor and I just, I can't address whether it would be perfect for you. I can just tell you what it says here, what it's good for, and my experience with it. So I hope you found this helpful. Thank you so much for taking the time to watch, and I will see you in the very next video. Bye. Ugh, I feel like I'm talking like weird. Hey everyone, today I am going to show... What was that? It was kind of like something just flying by. Maybe I should just stop the whole wave thing. I feel like it's my hands just like flying. Like, oh, it's a bird. It's a plane. It's Prissy's hand. Like, oh, I have bars out of five. That's big. Slow my roll. It is a, uh, what is it called?